Hiram Johnson High School in Sacramento's Tahoe Park just debuted their new field. And KCRA 3's Maricela De La Cruz is live from there where games started this afternoon. Maricela? Yeah, Lisa, so tonight is definitely warm for the books as this official new debut of the field. Many people coming out here and that excitement felt beyond the football teams. It's not your typical Friday night at Hiram Johnson High School. Tonight, the lights are on as players debut the new field. It's just super exciting and it's a great way to start the school year off. A somewhat long process. We've watched this, the field go in and then in the past year we've watched the lights and the stadium go in and the bleachers and so we have been anticipating this day for a very long time. But worth it for faculty, students and families alike. I'm looking forward to the next four years and uh, just to be able to support the school and the community to have a safe place for the kids to come and have a good time and then uh, enjoy the school. It's been about a year since construction was still taking place on campus. And today is a full circle moment for some. I graduated in 2008, so I was here like um, back in the days <laughs> when there was no stadium here. Macy Chow is back at Hiram Johnson just in time to support her son in a brand new field. Uh, happy that he's a uh, part of the team. He's been playing football since he was younger, and I'm just here to support him with the rest of the family members. And like dozens tonight is happy with the result. I think they did an awesome job. I think it's one of the best uh, football stadiums that I see. The field and athletic facilities cost the school $5.3 million and the track back there is going to be ready for track season. We are live in Sacramento, Maricela de la Cruz, KCRA 3 News. So exciting for all those students and their families. Thanks, Maricela.